Well, no one wants to think about our beautiful Northland summer coming to an end, but the days are getting shorter, and before you know it, the leaves will start changing. KBJ6 meteorologist Alex Libby explains how the drought could affect fall colors. Believe it or not, fall is right around the corner, and for Janelle Jones, the executive director of Love and Lake County, it's the best time of the year. We look forward to fall leaves on the North Shore. But many are wondering, what does this year's extreme drought mean for our fall colors? In years past, during drought conditions, the trees would turn earlier and also be a little bit less vibrant. Jasper Paternos, a tourist visiting from Rochester, Minnesota, has never been up here in the fall but he doesn't think an earlier fall color season would deter him from coming. Not necessarily. I think there's a lot of fun things to do up here, whether that's being outdoors or just more in the city. Brianna Saunders came up from the Twin Cities with her parents, and she disagrees. You want to come up here to see beautiful colors, and if they're not really there, then what's the point of coming up here? Jones says she is hoping for the best and is expecting long lines of cars along Highway 61 this fall. I don't think that the vibrancy is going to make that big of a difference. We have so many leaves up here and so much to offer up here. I think that everybody loves to come up here and enjoy the fall. They enjoy the weather. It's going to be gorgeous no matter what. With the dry conditions, when the leaves do turn, they won't last long. To keep up to date, we have a link to the state's current fall colors map on our website.